Uh, hey, Brandon, I uh, am out in front of the house uh, in Roy. Um, it is a nice house, nice neighborhood. It's one of these little pocket neighborhoods. There's probably 50 or so homes in here. Um, I sold a couple of these when they were building the neighborhood. Actually, one of my employees bought that, that bluish color house over there back when it was built. Um, so nice, quiet neighborhood, probably 80% military. Um, surrounded by farms and beyond that, I know you kind of know the area. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and head into the house. Um, regarding our conversation the other day, uh, again, I hate to be so negative, but this market has, has just gone insane. Um, and, uh, this morning, this is the third home that I'm out taking video of today. The last two that I had appointments for, both of them canceled on me because they received offers that were too good to refuse and the and the offers both came with very short responses and that is what we're seeing we're seeing people come in with either cash or a lot of cash and a small loan and they say you know i'll I'm, i'll make this offer it doesn't require an appraisal i might even not do an inspection but i want an answer today and they come in with something crazy you know fifty thousand cash above ask and you just can't compete with it. So I've had two today that, that did that to me. Um, so anyhow, well-maintained house. The I was going to mention on the outside, the siding on this home is a, a plywood type of siding. So it's lap siding. It looks very well-maintained. Uh, but it is the plywood type siding, not hardy board. And I remember that home that you guys owned. I want to say it was off 292nd. Seems like it was hardy board on it. So um, anyhow. So I'm just going to walk through. I don't remember if we did videos when you bought that house. I think we were exclusively in person. So um, I walk through. I try to look for the stuff that's not going to show up in video. Um, nice little pantry here, uh, which means I'm usually looking for the negative. Um, all right. Did I say video? I should have said uh, stuff that's not going to show up in pictures. So... Nice looking stuff. Looks like they've recently redone the uh, the kitchen. This is a, a manufactured quartz. Um, nice looking appliances. So, let me go ahead and step out back while I'm here. So, they've got a correctly wired hot tub. I'm I'm used to seeing those things with a freaking extension cord running across the yard. Um, nice play area here. I don't know about gravel underneath the swing set. But uh, anyway, nice play area. See a little bit of issue up here. I don't like it when people do this OSB or the particle board for roof sheeting. Because you can see there that it's it will start to take on moisture and get a little bit of mold in it and stuff. Um, so, anyhow, nice uh, kind of single car garage shed thingy. Um, I imagine that's just a box with a couple of windows in it. And it has uh, cement-based siding on it. It is not hardy it, from the pattern. It looks like it's uh, a different brand, but that is hardy, or, or that is a cement-based siding. Um, and the back... That's all wood uh, or plywood type stuff. Um, and that lower area obviously looks like the paint's faded quite a bit and it could use paint. I'm going to try and get a look up in here. Yeah, so you've got a little bit of discoloration up in there. Not bad, not bad. But the, those things tend to trap moisture. Heat rises, traps moisture. Um, and then with OSB specifically, uh, it gets into the wood. So this thing is well built. They've got it well supported. I don't know if we're on camera or not. We're not supposed to be. So. gas fire um, I'm assuming that there is a propane tank sitting here somewhere I haven't seen it but uh, it might be out behind that shed or something 
Um, but I am 99.9% .9 certain that there is not gas in this neighborhood. Natural gas, that is. And I'm going to guess this is a coat closet. Linen, probably, yep. Standard depth, that's about a two foot depth. The, uh, the floor coverings in here all look fantastic. No staining, clean, not original, they've been replaced. Guest bath, has that same quartz. Ceramic tile flooring, and the paint and everything is all in real good shape. Floor solid. I guess this is a child's bedroom. Oh, no, they're using it. Looks like as a sitting room TV. Oh, it is a child's bedroom. So nursery more than anything. And I am going to say that this room is about ten feet this direction and the usable space about 10 feet this direction so it's pretty close to a 10 by 10 square child's room uh kind of a typical closet but it is deeper than normal a normal closet like this is about 24 inches that looks like it's close to 30. again everything seems to be in good repair Kind of, I'm looking for sheetrock issues right now because they came and painted this, but they did a good job of it. I don't see any nail pops or anything. Everything I'm seeing looks good. It's a well-maintained home. Yes, this is master. Yeah. You got the tray ceiling. Large gun safe that I imagine is going with the with the uh, sellers. And uh, that that second child's room was a mirror image of the first one. This room uh, is. 17 or 18 feet from the corner there of that wall, this direction. Um, and I'm going to say 13, 14 feet this way. So lots of room for a king and, and adjacent or adjoining furniture. I don't know if you can see that in the picture, but there's, they've done some paint touch up there on that wall, but uh, it does, I can see it on my camera or on my phone. It looks a lot more pronounced on the phone than it does in person. I can, I can barely see it with my naked eye. <clears throat> Get some light going here. Okay, so master closet. is a I'm gonna say about a five by seven space um, I'm gonna guess this is another closet yeah, this is more of a linen type thing and not the throne so another closet shoe closet I guess you would call it and this is another five by five five by six <clears throat> tub is nice but not jetted um and ceramic tile countertop ceramic tile floor or is it nope oh, this vinyl floor i'm sorry it's fine it looks like it might be vinyl tile um, I don't know if you've seen those, but they're almost like the snap click uh, floor, wood floor, but they're a tile. So, good size shower.
and not a private throne room, but at least you got a little separation there. So I'm going to head out this way. And I've been in that closet. Miss this bathroom. And then coming back to the front door, we have a little sitting room here. And uh, I'm looking for the garage door. So kind of a small closet here. Um, oh. yeah. And I would have to look at the listing. I don't know if they're counting this room as a bedroom or not. Obviously, it's not a bedroom. And I'm, I guess we got to go through the laundry. I walk right past the laundry. Uh, again, and I'd have to look at the listing. I doubt the washer and dryer convey with the home. Um, they might, but typically they do not. And it looks like the garage is not used as a garage. It's used as a workout room. And storage. They have it set up pretty nice. Um, I don't know how much of this storage is going to stay. I'm sure they're planning to remove all of the uh, workout equipment. Um, that heater up there I would expect to stay. Anyhow, I think that's about the end of the tour, and I will get this video uh, uploaded and over to you, um, and see what you think. Uh, I will talk to you guys soon. Thank you.